Snow Creek writes RMSO. I had a close encounter with the Bigfoot three years ago in May of 2014. It happened in a mobile home park I lived at in a small town called Gazelle in Northern California by Mount Shasta. I was not home by myself when this happened. The encounter happened two nights in a row. The Bigfoot shook the trailer, growling through my window and bumping the trailer really hard. RMSO responds, crazy, did you get a good look at it? If so, did you see facial features, height, color, or anything else? Snow Creek writes back, no, I did not look at it. I was very scared, but the person that was with me at home went outside and he saw something very tall walking towards the property behind where we lived. After the second night that it happened, the day I saw scratches on my window and my friend found hair on the electric pole next to the trailer, the hair was orangish brownish gray. It was a big chunk of hair. Before all this happened, I read up on Bigfoots to know their behaviors and where they like to hide. There has been times I heard their sounds in that area before the close encounter happened and after that. RMSO responds. Do you remember any other details or any more experiences? We would like to hear about them. Snow Creek responds. A few months before that close encounter happened, I was home all by myself. It was around 8 p.m. in the evening. It was still light outside, but starting to get dark. I heard a growl outside near my window. Then that was it. The year before in the summertime, one night the trailer shook but not too hard. Hi, Snow Creek. This is Kelly with Rocky Mountain Sasquatch Organization responding. Really appreciate hearing about your encounter. There's a lot of Bigfoot sightings, a lot of paranormal activity around the Mount Shasta volcano and the Mount Shasta area. I know of several Bigfoot sightings off the top of my head, like a man collecting pine cones that had to retreat from a Bigfoot intimidation approach. And then also the Lake Shasta Caverns Bigfoot encounter. I will leave links to those two videos in the description of this video on YouTube. If you would like to go see those, there's a lot of Bigfoot sightings in that area. We really appreciate you sending us yours keep on watching. We're going to keep on squatching.